us enlightened people in some far off metropole, we're going to tell you how to do things. And that's just really the fundamental relationship. I think that's really uh, being appreciated more and more in the U.S. Now, there's always going to be that strain of thought among people who don't even view national borders as relevant, right? Neoconservatives. So we'll, we'll just we'll invade whatever country we have to uh, under humanitarian grounds. But the idea of invading foreign countries for humanitarian reasons, again, is the exact same logic as sending federal marshals into Texas or Wyoming or some state that isn't doing things in accordance with the edicts of the federal government. It's, I really don't see a real distinction there other than this arbitrary idea that, hey, we're all Americans. But here's the thing. If, if people in another part of America are so culturally different from you that you find their way of life uh, abhorrent to the point that you have to send in the federal government to correct that, are you really all Americans? That would suggest that uh, the definition of being an American has to be broadened sort of significantly or the term doesn't apply to people everywhere in America. So uh, we're getting, I think, to that point where either if... America means, yeah, I tolerate people in other parts of the country doing things differently, or you need to make America smaller so as to not include those people who do things in a way you find disgusting.